What's going on, YouTube gang? It's Mel DFS coming to you live and direct. Here to give my favorite plays for today is a 10 game main slate. Hope everybody's having a great day. Feel free to like the video. Please subscribe to the channel. Press that bell icon to always stay notified for new videos. Sorry for the late videos. I've been dealing with a major headache. I have enough time to where I could at least get these plays out for y'all for today. Let's jump into it. Going to first play at point guard. We're going to pay up West Westbrook in a good spot here. Knowing LeBron James is out once again, he's going to have the ball. He had 39 minutes last game, 64 fantasy points. Going against his former team, OKC, should be a great game to consider. Going against his former team, we had 70 fantasy points, 58 in the last two games. Also, Anthony Davis is questionable. But West Westbrook definitely should dominate in this play. All right, now we'll go for a saving spot. Let's go down to Ish Smith for Charlotte. Rozier is out again, so 4K for a guy that's definitely been paying his price tag. He's a 23.5 projection play. Um, love this play going against Orlando, so go for a guy that can give you that 20 plus in this matchup. He's averaging 25 fantasy points in the last two games, averaging around 21 minutes a game. So Ish Smith, great value at point guard. All right, let's go to our next play. Our shooting guards, CJ McCollum is in a smashing spot at 7,800 on DraftKings. 49.8 projection play with a 6.4 value play. Definitely isn't a great play. 44, 34, 47, 41, 50 in the last five against Memphis is a great play. He's averaging 46.1 fantasy points a game, around 32 minutes a game. So love this play for CJ McCollum and a great matchup for today. All right, let's go to our next play. To our small forwards, go to Anthony Edwards, 7,700 on DraftKings, 8K on Fanduel. But love this DraftKings price, 44.5 in projection play, averaging 44.3 fantasy points a game with 36 minutes a game. And Edwards has also been a great play. He had 36 last game against the Bucks. Should be a great play overall for Edwards. Also a great pace for Minnesota, 101.9 to 103.4 for Anthony Edwards, and a great matchup for today. Another play is Miles Bridge. He's been dominant. Well, Rozier, 7,200 on DraftKings, still too cheap here. Averaging 45.4 fantasy points a game. Definitely these lines should be mid-tier down this lineup for today. So I like these plays, definitely in consideration. We also got Desmond Bain at 48. is also a great play. 31.9 projection play. Averaging 34.2 fantasy points a game in the last three. So I like the spot for today. For the next play, going to our power forwards. Did talk about Miles Bridges. Uh, let's go for another play by Evan Mobley, 7K on DraftKings against Clippers, in which he's been an up-down trend lately, 42, 28, 43, went down 24, so it should be an up-down matchup. I like the trend where he could give you that 40-plus in this matchup, so going against the Clippers should be a dominant play for Evan Mobley for today. I like Wendell Carter Jr. at 57 on both platforms. It's, to me, it's a great play overall. Uh, he's averaging 29.7 face points a game, 35, 33, 23 in the last three games. So something to consider for the win of Carter against Charlotte. That was 26 against the position in this great play. All right, let's go to our last play. Go to our centers. Great mid-tier spots. DeAndre Ayton, 6,600 on DraftKings, 68 on FanDuel, and a great play against Sacramento, which he has been dominant against them. 43, 37, 28, 36 in the last four. So nice little uptrend for DeAndre Ayton in this play against Sacramento. Also a great pace, 100.1 to 101.3, and which Sacramento is 26 against the position, 23rd overall in defense. So DeAndre Ayton isn't a great play and just a great price tag overall. Clint Capella, 6,500 on DraftKings is too cheap. Even FanDuel at 7,200 going against the Pelicans, which should be a should be a dominant spot as well. 28th against the position, a 29.3 projection play. But against Pelicans, he has been easy getting upside. 36, 43, 45 in the last three. So like Clint Capella as well. These are my favorite plays. Y'all like the plays? Give a thumbs up. Any questions, comment below. Using Draft Dashboard tools and link in my description. You want access? It's a dollar up to 30 days. Once you sign up, you get access to the NBA cheat sheet, your sleepers, and your studs. Click on Watch Players. You get access to my player pool up top for Watch Mel's DFS picks up top for either DraftKings or FanDuel. So I love y'all. Y'all collect that bag. It's Mel DFS, and y'all stay blessed. And I'll see y'all in the next video.